let's go to the uh, the bottom game because I'm sure there's been a letter again been sent out. It's Leipzig at minus 140, Freiburg at plus 340, the draw is at plus 320. Um, anytime goal scorer letter gone out in this game, Kev? Yeah, absolutely. Keep going for Nkunku because, uh, you know, he is still, uh, I mean, at the time we uh, we kind of generated our picks, uh, and it tells you how confident I am, didn't even have a price on him at the time. The market hadn't even been made because we had the, the midweek Back-to-back games. But uh, it, it's still worth it because I know he's going to be an attractive price because he keeps getting put up at odds against and he keeps on scoring goals. I, I think people will get a little bit squeamish about this because they'll look at Freiburg and say, well, Freiburg are doing incredibly well. Big. Yeah, look, that's too big. Yes, absolutely. I would snap that up because the guy... Uh, <laughs> The guy got 35 goals last season. He's got, he's in way into double figures this season. He's got 10 alone in the, um, he's in double figures alone in the Bundesliga, let alone everywhere else. And he has shown in the last few weeks that he can score free kicks. He's got two of those. He can score penalties. He can score long range goals. He can score short range goals. He can score headers. You name it, he can do it. Timo Werner being out means that he's even more of a focal point in attack. And this is a Freiburg team, a a Leipzig team, sorry, that have won all seven of their home games under Marco Rosa. And they've scored at least twice in all of those wins. And I think in all but one, they've scored at least three goals. So this is a Leipzig team playing well, scoring goals. And we're kind of getting to the point with Nkunku where it actually doesn't matter who he's playing. Because if he's odds against... And you fancy Leipzig to to get some goals in a game. He's absolutely worth exploiting, I think. So uh, let's stay on that train while we can. Freiburg, I think, have done incredibly well. Incredibly well. I mean, if you look at how they've balanced the Europa League and the Bundesliga, it's really quite phenomenal. Because that squad is not mega strong. It shows the conditioning is excellent. The fitness work that they do. Christian Streich has always been a, an excellent leader. And Vincenzo Grifo is having the season of his life. So uh, Freiburg opposed a threat. Freiburg want revenge as well because Leipzig beat them in the cup final last season. But I just think this could become a bit of a knockabout game, really. And I think Nkunku will get chances to score. So at plus 130, he's absolutely, for me, the standout bet here. Yeah, you imagine go near the Leipzig minus 140 because you can have Leipzig to score twice at minus 140. I'm going to uh, put a little bit of a pin in your balloon, Alex, though, because I seriously thought that Freiburg could have been a possibility not to score here at plus 180. No, 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 thank you. Uh, no, 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 obviously what, I don't what, want to do that. What I wanted to say to you is that um, while uh, Kev was uh, talking about Nkunku, I went to the Bundesliga Futures that we filmed three months ago, and I see the best bets for the Futures. So both Kevin and I went to Nkunku, um, top scorer of the league, at plus 450, and I went Nkunku over 16.5 goals uh, all season long at minus 120, which was a banker. So he has he's what, nearly now? there. <laughs> eleven right now? Yeah, eleven. Yeah, he's got eleven. So he needs he needs six goals for that banker to cash. Okay, it's not a, so big the odds at minus one twenty, but still uh, he's making things uh, look so easy. And uh, we thought that uh, with um, Timo Werner coming, he will not score that much, you know. But he's there. He's there. He's scoring week in and week out, and. At uh, plus 150 to uh, this week, why not to take him? So, yeah, uh, absolutely amazing uh, uh, player. Uh, on the other side, I think that uh, I think that Freiburg are uh, having a superb season. I think that they are again uh, showing that uh, last season was not a mistake. Uh, they are there right now, second on the table. Uh, 27 points, only one behind Bayern Munich. And I think that they can score against uh, Leipzig. This is why I'm going with the goals market. Uh, the, the players are brilliant. The, the, the front line is, is great. Uh, that duo, the Gregorich duo and Grifo, uh, are performing amazing. Yeong and Duan uh, in the middle, both great uh, with great pace, both of them. 
um, many many goals uh, from set pieces. Uh, I think that this should be a, an amazing game. I, I see it uh, a two two a three two for Leipzig. Uh, Leipzig has the first chance playing at home. Uh, brilliant uh, performance lately from Leipzig. Um, so yeah, this will be an exciting match to even to watch and uh, for live in play action. Okay, let's have a little look at the official picks. Thought this was going to be a really uh, tight, tight game, to be honest. Um, but anyway, I'm not putting my money down, so I've got no opinion. Uh, Nkunku, anytime goal scorer, plus 150. Alex Classic, both teams scoring over two and a half at plus 105.